with his with his long hair, he does definitely needs a good brush. Yeah. Charles the cat may look a little rough around the edges, but it's really no surprise. He somehow managed to wander about 1,300 miles from his home in New Mexico to Chicago. Nobody knows exactly how this traveling tabby made the trek to the Windy City, but he had been missing for about eight months, and his luck didn't run out here. Charles wound up at the Chicago Animal Care and Control and was on the list to be euthanized until workers made a discovery that probably saved his life. Charles got here about a week or so ago, and at some point during that time that he was here, we checked him for microchip and found out that he, in fact, had a microchip. Workers used that chip to contact Charles's owner, Robin Alex. She says she's not at all surprised her cat made the trip. It makes sense that he would be my cat. I'm originally from Seattle, and I've moved around a lot. My roommate and I have traveled all over the place, and so it seems kind of destined that my cat would be a traveling cat. But now this cruising cat has run into another problem. Alex can't afford the round-trip flight to Chicago to pick up Charles. I would feel so terrible knowing that he had survived this whole ordeal just to be put down because nobody can get him out of a shelter. But another Albuquerque resident came to the rescue. Headed to Chicago for a trip, he said he would go to the shelter and bring Charles back home. That is, at least until his next adventure. Nicole Grether, The Associated Press.